People look at stories through different lenses. I have my own personal take on some of these trending issues. Hi, I'm Mariah Ramharak and welcome to In Case You Missed It. Hi and welcome back to In Case You Missed It. The ICC T20 Men's World Cup is in full swing, but unfortunately it will go on without the West Indies. The team never really got going and bowed out of the tournament with yet another subpar showing. One player that can at least be proud of an honest effort though is Alzari Joseph. These days there are a few things to smile about when it comes to West Indies cricket. After witnessing the team's shaky and consistent performance at this tournament, however, it's clear the development and attitude of young Joseph is at least one of them. Joseph's impressive man of the match figures against Zimbabwe 4 for 16 was a standout moment and proved crucial in saving off what would surely have been an embarrassing exit after just two matches. The figures were his best ever in T20 cricket, but it was more than just that. In an era where we often see lax-looking players smile after a poor delivery or botched fielding effort, Azari's spiky no-nonsense approach is a breath of a fresh air. In fact, the player has not been shy to let teammates know when they have fallen below the standard on the field, with quite a few serious glares flashed towards the guilty parties. Yes, at least we know this guy cares. Since breaking into the team in 2016, Alzari has shown us that he's serious about the game. He has gone about his business with a workmanlike intensity that is a real throwback to the great days of West Indies cricket. We Caribbean people have always been known for our fun-loving and relaxed attitude to many things. But on the cricket pitch, we were always warriors. Just take a look at these fellows. You just hate to be standing at the other end of any of their deliveries. These days, one of our all-time favorites, Sir Kutli Ambrose, is frequently all smiles in the commentary boot and even showed off some wonderful moves on Dancing with the Stars. In his day though, ask anyone, Ambi from the bowler's end was never a laughing matter. Joseph is one of a handful of players from the golden youth generation who captured the ICC Under-19 World Cup in 2016 to make a successful transition to the senior level. Since then, the bowler has constantly looked to push for more. He's a man of few words, but he's always in great shape, steady and seemingly single-minded when it comes to improving his cricket craft. Joseph has put his cricket first and luckily for us, that commitment and dedication seem to be about to bear fruit. We don't want to call any names here on in case you missed it, but we honestly wish a few more of our youth players had copied this approach. Well, that's a wrap for today's In Case You Missed It. Be sure to like, share and comment and let us know what your thoughts are on the growth of Joseph and his future in West Indies cricket. Goodbye for now.